It's election day in Georgia, where two runoffs will decide which party controls the U.S. Senate. President Trump is urging Georgians to get out and vote for Republicans David Perdue and Kelly Loeffler on Twitter. But at a, at a rally last night, he was more focused on his own election loss, repeating false claims that Republican election officials in Georgia have debunked. ABC's Elwin Lopez joins me now from Atlanta with more. Elwin, where do things stand right now in these races in Georgia? Yeah, Diane, so a festive theme here at this polling location in Fulton County. It is the largest county in the state, and polls are virtually tied. Democrats have showed up in high numbers in early voting, especially in vote by mail. And Democrat John Ossoff visited a polling location today, and here's what he had to say. Georgia voters have never had more power than they have right now, today, to make history. And so if you are still awaiting that trip to the polls, if you still haven't gone and cast your ballot, if you're in Georgia right now, make a plan to vote. As long as you are there by 7 p.m., your vote will be counted and you can be part of history. That was on GMA3 today. He also spoke at a polling location here nearby in Fulton County. And it's also important to point out that Republicans show up in high numbers on Election Day, but it could be days until we have the final results, Diane. And Ellen, we can hear the music playing in the background. What are you hearing from voters there on the ground? What's the vibe like there today? Well, I can tell you this. It is definitely festive. And before the doors even opened here, there were more than a dozen people waiting in line. A lot of voters saying that they are just happy to be able to vote in this special election. And it is so important for them to turn out today, not only because they received, like myself, a ton of texts, phone calls, and mail, but just because they believe it is especially important now. Take a listen. I just felt it was my civic duty to to let my voice be heard. I hope that people just see how how much it how important it is to vote in, in every single election. Um, and I think that's that's been the the statement so so far is that um, you know elections are important. They matter. Um, it's important for everyone's voice to be heard. Georgians understand that the stakes here are high. Already more than three million people voted ahead of today. That is double early turnout from 2018. Diane. All right, Ellen Lopez for us in Atlanta. Thanks, Ellen. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.